Welcome back to the Truck Stop, everybody. How are you? Hopefully, you guys are having a fantastic freaking weekend. Today, we're going to talk about fishing. If you guys have not done fishing, all right, it is a very, very, very good way to get a lot of cool items, okay? Um, I mean, for example, we're going to go fishing here in a minute, and I'm also going to show you my new uh, uh, thing that I built. But, so far I have caught three enchantment books, um, a power level four, uh, I forget, unbreaking level one, and blah, 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 blah. I have caught wooden bowls, I caught a saddle, which we'll go take a look at my horse here in a second. Um, I mean, I have caught, you know, enchanted bows, enchanted fishing rods, I mean, you can see the one on the screen now. Um, ink, uh, black ink, um, I mean, I, lily pads, I, I've caught so many cool things. If you guys have not gone fishing, spend a couple days fishing, because you will get some really good stuff. So, with that being said, before we start the fishing escapade, where's my horse? I think I figured out, oh, come on, I think I figured out why my critters are leaving. There's my horse, there's my saddle, see, hey buddy, how you doing, how you doing, what are you jumping up there for, get down, you can't get up there, you can't get up there, okay, you're a dumbass, but now, you're going, but I don't live by a lake, you don't have to. Watch this. All right, we'll do this one. Watch this. You don't have to live by a lake. You can make your own pond. So, and it doesn't even have to be this big. It can be smaller than this. Um, I have caught um, a bunch of stuff in the uh, one by one or the one block pond that I have in, inside my barn. So, you don't necessarily have to have a lake. Now it's gonna not, it's gonna prove me wrong. Are you kidding me? It worked. I swear to God it worked. What is, see? See, puffer fish, ha 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 ha. What am I doing? I keep forgetting I can't run by pushing R3. Or L3. So here we go. See, so watch. There, this this hook is in. It's just one deep by one square. That's all it is. And you can catch stuff. So if you have a bucket or whatever, or if it gets nighttime like it is now, um, you don't even have to go outside. You can stay in the... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, dude, get out of here. Um, just try to keep your horse and stuff away from you. Because he's a little possessed. But... Uh, now it's gonna... Come on. Come on. The only thing is, though, is... With this... The one... The smaller the pond, the quicker you need to be with your reaction time. So, um, it's a little difficult, but it is very doable. What is what is that horse doing? Okay, I'm going to reset. There we go. It does really work, I promise you. Um, or you can do a two by two, you know, like I did out there, two, two by two by one. See, there you go, fish. Um, so yeah, you don't have to live by a very large body of water like I do. You can just make your own. Um, it does work with the garden ponds that I have upstairs. It does work in that size of a pond as well. Um, it works. I mean, you've seen, you know, a two by two. 
Um, but here's where I catch a lot of good stuff is right here. And it sounds weird. I know it does. It sounds very weird. But you can catch a lot of cool stuff. So, you know, if you guys have not tried fishing, you know, whether you're a beginner or, you know, you're an expert player at Minecraft, which I am not, um, you know, you can catch saddles, like I said, um, enchant enchanted tools and, you know, fishing rods, bows, um, enchantment books, uh, bottles of water. I mean, you can catch, I mean, if you like fish, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> fish is you know, going to be your main diet for a while. Um, you know, I've caught, what, three, four different kinds of fish now. Um, you can see the puffer, the blue fish, the red fish, and then a clown fish. Um, there's the red fish. But, yeah, seriously, if you guys need some good stuff you know i like i said i've caught leather pieces i've caught for some dumb reason rotten flesh i'm not sure how that works but yeah if you, there's no recipe for a saddle so if you guys have if you guys need a saddle this is a very 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 good way to catch you know a saddle um what else have i caught in uh, lily pads. I've caught uh, name tags. I'm not sure what to do with those um, yet. Uh, bowls. Um, tons of fish. I mean, that's obviously why what you're going to catch the most of. Ink. Uh, like I said, three, two or three enchantment books. Uh, two bottles of water. Uh, there's more I can't think of it right now but yeah there's I I can't tell you guys enough if you guys are playing Minecraft and you're new or an expert or anywhere in between and you have not gone fishing yet you what the fuck are you waiting for <laughs> first of all second of all um, you know it really is. I mean, you're seeing it's it's just as simple. I mean, it's boring after a while, but the more the more cool stuff you catch, the the more you want to do it to see what you can catch next. So, all right, we're gonna do a couple more casts and then we're gonna go um, visit the new thing that I built on my world. This is. Everybody can use it. It's not just mine. And it's pretty cool if you ask me. But, alright, a couple more. Yeah, so, like I said, oh shoot, I missed that one. Gosh dang it. Um, you can see the enchantment book one. This is one I won on breaking and metting, uh, fishing. Um, that's the one I got. And stuff like that. Um, yeah, it is it is well worth the time. Let me put it that way. It is well worth the time. So far, I have... But I don't know. I fished for like two days in one night straight. And pretty much caught all that stuff. So... Um, it's a very productive way to get some cool items um, while you're playing Minecraft. Alright, last one, and then we'll go check out the building. Last one. Give me something good, game. Give me something good. Let me show the people what you can get. Oh, uh, no, it's more fish. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. I got skunked. But, alright, close the deer. Where are you? We're gonna go out this way. What the fuck are you doing? There's my moo moo. Hey, there's my horsey. There's my chicken or duck looking thing. Oh. 
Um, if you guys noticed, I only have one dog. There was a little bit of a mishap. Um, Junior was uh, goofing around with some stuff. And bam! Look at that. Isn't that not cool? Oh, shoot. You know what, dude? Get out of here. This is my spot. All right. So. I don't think he can get up here. If he can get up here, I'm going to be pissed. Can he explode in the water? Get out of here. I don't think he can explode in the water. That's cool. Yeah, come here. Come here. Come here. You know you want a piece of me? Come here. Come here. Little bastard. Little green fucking bastard. Alright. Oh, there's a horse right there. Shoot, I don't have my rope. Oh well. Alright. Welcome to the fishing shack. It's fairly safe. You can fish while it's lightning and all that good stuff. So let's try it out. And I also want to point out too, the reason why I say the smaller ponds are a little bit harder, watch the water when you see this weird little like ripple coming towards your hook get ready um, that's why the bigger the pond the the better um, where is it watch the bobber watch the bobber come on come on there you go see right in front of us there you go Boom. See? Watch for that. Don't watch it. Just watch for it. Um, because that's a good sign that something's coming after your hook. So get ready to pull it in. Um, basically, it's just left R2 or L2 to throw it out and L2 to bring it back in. There's nothing to it. You use very little energy. Um, the only reason why mine's going down is because I fell right before I started recording so anyways if you hopefully we catch something cool I don't think it you have to be at a certain spot or anything like that um, I think it's just random catching whatever you want to call it um, so yeah I don't think you have to be at a certain spot. I think you just have to put in the time, I guess, if you want to call it that. Uh, la, 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 la. Oops, I missed that one. Oh, by the way, that house is still up for grabs. So if you guys want to come hang out and, you know, go fishing with me and all that good stuff, um, you know, look me up all the information is below it's a uh, trucker 37 1977 and come claim that house and let's do some fishing and get some cool stuff because it is it's kind of addicting you want to see what you can get so hopefully it gives me something cool to show you guys I might have to cut some of this out <laughs> and kind of fish by myself uh, more fish but I'm gonna try to keep this one a little bit shorter so did you guys watch the boomtown video was that not cool uh, me and junior literally worked for like five hours six hours or whatever it was um, to make that video 
it was it was a lot of fun watching it blow up and stuff but um, a portion of it kind of didn't want to cooperate but <laughs> it, it was still a lot of fun I that was that was a blast to make literally haha <laughs> no pun uh, more fi oh my lord why is it I tried making a video about fishing um, the other night and that's just, this is all I caught was fish. I didn't catch anything else but fish. It's like, oh my gosh, what are you doing? No, stop. I want something cool. Uh, I really want another saddle so I can have two horses. Uh, but I don't know if that's going to work. We'll see. We'll see what we catch this time. If not, I'm done with the video. And I'm just going to keep on fishing. There we go. See? Tripwire hook. I got a couple of those too. So, yeah, you can catch a lot of cool stuff. You got a lot of useful stuff. You'll catch bones and stuff like that too, which is really dumb because you can get catch so many bones or get so many bones just walking around in the morning so I don't understand why we have to catch bones but whatever all right yeah so you can I mean you can kind of see you can catch a lot of cool stuff um, a lot of useful stuff so you know like the saddle and the bowls and um, bottles of water and, and stuff like that so if you have a brew station you know, you can brew some spells or something. I, you know, whatever it is. Um, if you guys want me to do a a, a video on the brew station, um, I, I can. Uh, just leave comments below. And see, there. The, the, speak of the devil, I just caught a bone. But, <laughs> anyways, boys and girls, that's fishing. If you have not done it. Please go try it. You will not be sorry. It's a lot of fun. Um, it's boring and a lot of fun all at the same time, which I know is a contradiction of itself. But anyways, if you're new around here, thank you so much for finding the channel and taking the time to watch the videos. If you guys and girls want, hit that thumbs up. Everyone, if you enjoyed this video or any of the videos, give me that thumbs up. It does mean a lot. It does help a lot. So the more thumbs up you guys give, the more we know you guys are into what we're doing. And also, it helps right now with the way YouTube is. So hit that thumbs up button. Um, for the new boys and girls, if you guys want to subscribe, that's awesome. Grab your permanent spot at the truck stop. And until next time, be safe. And always write cool on that stool. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.